Hello, and welcome to one of the tiniest unboxings I've ever done. This, my friends, is Appointment on Sunset by Tim Powers, a little short story published by Charnel House a few years back. Now, this is still available through Charnel House, <clears throat> Joe Stefko's publishing, uh, publishing house. And, uh, you know, it's uh, $150 retail. I got this for a pretty good deal in the secondary market for beneath retail, so I was pretty excited about that. Now, this is courtesy of Zig's Books. I was the same guy that I purchased a couple other uh, Charnel House titles through, including Poems, uh, which uh, I had a fun time doing the Poems video. Not many people watched that one, but that's fine. Uh, mostly because it's probably because it's rather an annoying video. It's a small little volume, and I did the entire thing in verse. Cheesy ass rhymes. Anyways, I'm not going to do cheesy ass rhymes here. Now, this is number 132 of 150, and you will see that, yeah, the limitation and the signature are right in the cover there on an actual toe tag. So, um, I haven't read this short story yet, but I know it deals with a man dying in a car crash on Sunset Boulevard in the 1960s and being brought back in, uh, they say present time, so I guess the actual present time, to kind of atone and try to do things differently. A charnel house likes to... I think it's really cool that it's kind of embedded in the front there. Charnel, Charnel House likes to embed stuff in the covers of the books, usually the lettered editions. We got a little kind of design on, you know, a little to the fabric of the end papers. Whoa, and very thick page stock here that is messing with my mind. Kind of doing an optical illusion thing. Are they all thick? Oh, wow, they are. These pages are thick as hell. So, yeah, it's only like 40-something pages, but uh, that's a decent size 40-something because it's like thick cardstock for the pages, which is very interesting. You know, a little more high quality being a 48-page short story. It's 2014 now, so it is present time. Uh, yeah, so like I said, small, small text blocks on each, like a paragraph on each page, 48 pages. Could probably read this in no time at all. One little sitting, obviously. And, uh, but yeah, it's a very interesting publication. <clears throat> so this was hand-bound. Yes, it's bound in full indigo cave paper boards, which is the same type that was used for The Skies Discrowned, I believe. Uh, 26 lettered copies in full dark blue Moroccan leather. Hmm. All right. Uh, so, yeah, it's kind of got, like, very lettered-ish qualities, you could say, especially with something embedded in the front boards. Uh, usually those are reserved for the lettered editions from Charnel House. Uh, the Regulators by Richard Bachman had bullets embedded. Uh, there was another Tim Powers title that had, uh, oh, an Etch-A-Sketch bound into the cover, a working Etch-A-Sketch, or actual tarot cards for their lettered editions. So yeah, they, Joe Stefko likes binding stuff right into the cover. So there you have it. Nice quick little unboxing. Uh, this is Appointment on Sunset. You can buy it, like I said, for $150 directly through Charnel House. Same thing through Camelot Books if you prefer to buy through them. Or sometimes you can watch the secondary market and get lucky, save, save a couple bucks. But yeah, nice little hand-bound volume, roughly the same size as Poems. It's like actually a little bit bigger than like the, the, the little books the, that uh, Borderlands Press does. But nice size volume. Uh, so yeah, seriously, check out Charnel House. They do great publications, and they've announced that they are going to do every single Tim Powers book they haven't already done, uh, which they started with The Skies Discrowned, and they're working up from there. So you'll get Anubis Gates, Drawing of the, uh, drawing of the Dark, and so on. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Please check out the rest of the videos on the channel, and we'll see you around next time.